Okay, the question is, an object is released from a stationary hot air balloon at the height h above the ground. An identical object is released at height h above the ground from another balloon that is rising at the constant speed, that is rising up. So there are two balloons. Uh, one stone is thrown from one balloon, which is stationary, but the other balloon is rising up. So it is having certain velocity. It is having certain initial velocity. So the stone on the second balloon will be having some initial velocity in the upward direction. Okay. Initially, air resistance is negligible. What does not increase for the object released from the rising balloon? Okay. So out of the following options like A, B, C, D, which is the physical quantity, which is basically same in both of the cases, which does not increase or might be decreased also. But anyways, let us see. To be very clear about the question, there are two balloons now. Let us see. So there is a, there is a stone here and this is a stationary balloon. and it is dropped from this so obviously the initial velocity here will be equal to zero but in the second case the balloon is rising up with certain velocity let us say u and there is also a stone here let us say there is this stone so this stone is having an upward velocity it is u now and now it is thrown up like uh, it is thrown up with the velocity u so it will first go upside and then it will reach the zenith point and then it will fall to the ground so this is the complete description of the of this thing so what does not change let us see the distance through which it falls well definitely it will change uh, so this option is wrong because it will go straight forward downwards but it will go up so distance is different time taken for it to reach the ground well, definitely the time will also increase because this is having more distance, so time will increase. The speed with which it reaches the ground, well, that is also bound to increase. Uh, the velocity with which it is moving up, so as a characteristic of the projectile motion, you can say, or characteristic of the motion under gravity, the body, when it reaches back to this position, it will be moving down with the velocity u only this is a characteristic of this kind of a motion that at all the points which are horizontal at the same level they would be having uh, the magnitude of the velocity will be same for both of the points one velocity will be in upward direction another will be in downward direction but the magnitude will be same so this will definitely reach here with a higher velocity there is no doubt and the speed this is also different this is also different so what is not different it's acceleration well exactly this answer is absolutely correct because both of the bodies are getting accelerated with the acceleration due to gravity that is g which is 9.8 meter per second square so our answer will be definitely d all the best